This is how I make my beef stroganoff. You're going to take your beef and you're going to slice it on the bias against the grain. It makes the meat more tender. And then you're going to cut it into bite-sized pieces. Um, season those pieces up any way you want to. I just use salt and pepper and some Cajun seasoning. I put a little bit of olive oil on there and sprinkled some flour on it. Um, this will serve as a thickener later. I tossed it around. I got my skillet heating on the stove. I made some beef broth since I didn't have any. I used bouillon. I chopped up one onion. And then I chopped up one clove of garlic. When my skillet was nice and hot, I put a little olive oil in it. And then I seared my meat. You want to put it in one layer and leave it for at least five to seven minutes because you want it to get that crust on it. And then you're going to kind of stir it around and brown it. And then you're going to remove it from your skillet into a bowl. You're going to put two tablespoons of butter in your skillet and you're going to melt it. And then you're going to add your onions and garlic and half a container of white button mushrooms. Go ahead and soften that up and season it up any way you want to. You're going to add one tablespoon of Dijon mustard. You're going to add as much Worcestershire sauce as you want to. And then you're going to stir that around. Add your beef broth. It was two cups. Stir that around. You're going to add your beef back to your skillet. And then you're going to um, bring that up to a boil. And then you're going to reduce it to a simmer. And you're going to let it go for about 20 minutes. You want to taste it and make sure it's seasoned as you um, like it seasoned. Add one half cup of sour cream and stir that around. If you find that your sauce is too loose, you can bring it up to a boil and reduce the sauce by half. Um, and I like to serve this over egg noodles.